cracking the code to get the breakthrough. Okay, uh, it might sound a bit silly, but actually that is what this episode is about. And it came out of a question. Uh, we asked if you could lock Bernadette in a room for 15 minutes and ask her anything, what would you ask? And one of the questions came up was, Bernadette, how did you crack the code to get that breakthrough? So there's a short answer to this question and a long answer. If you want to crack the code of an online business, I can tell you right now what the code is. There's only two things you need to focus on. You need to focus on growing your list, growing a list of prospects, people who've raised their hands and expressed an interest. And then you need to make paid offers to that list. In fact, you need to put things in front of that list that they want to pay for and say yes to. That's it. That is a code of the online business. It's cracked. You don't need to ask any more questions about that. If you want to know more about the how to do all of that, there's lots of other videos on my YouTube channel that show you how to do both of those things. However, this is the long answer to the question. What does it really mean to have a breakthrough? And when I was asked this question, it kind of stumped me because I'm like, well, when, at what point in my life did I have a breakthrough? And I realized that that's not how I look at my life. If I look back over my history, I don't pick one day or one defining moment and go, that was B-Day, <laughs> breakthrough day. Because the truth is, if I look back over my journey, there's been a series of breakthroughs. There's been a series of shifts on the inside and then shifts on the outside that overall and cumulatively added up results. Now, to an outside observer, it might have looked as though there was a key moment. In fact, I remember someone who had been reading my email newsletter since about 2004 um, contacted me and said, hey, you know, I used to get your newsletter and now I see that you're on Necker Island with Richard Branson, which I did for the first time in 2011. And I've been back five times in total. And so I could appreciate that to the outside observer, it looks like, oh, hey, not so long ago, Bernadette was just like me. She was growing her email list and sending out content. And now she's made it. But those are all external comparisons. You know, and the fact is all of us need to be driven and we needed to find what our own breakthroughs are. So it's not really about what's happening on the outside. It's like where you are um, internally in relation to your business. So it might sound like a convoluted um, answer to the question, but the truth is to me, there isn't any breakthrough point. It's a series of breakthroughs. And the way to make sure that you're having a series of breakthroughs is to really just compare yourself to your own standards. So the question to ask every day is, am I making progress based on where I was yesterday or last week or a month ago? And sometimes in life, it may seem like you're not making progress. So sales have plateaued or, um, you know, business might have plateaued or it might have even gone down. And yet internally, what's happening on the inside is you might be going through tremendous growth and shifts in uh, beliefs or identity or sense of possibility about what you can do. And in my experience, often when it looks as though things are plateauing on the outside, there's actually a lot going on in the inside. And then the breakthrough, the apparent breakthrough that is visible and evident to lots of other people on the outside has actually been building up for months inside. So, um, yeah, cracking the crowd on the, on the breakthrough. I know there's lots of videos you can see on YouTube will say, I claim to have cracked the code. I personally don't claim I've cracked the code. I'm a work in progress. I'm still learning about life every single day and long may that continue. Hello. You. Yes, you. Yes, you. If you like my mummy's videos, my mummy is Bernadette Doyle, by the way, you need to hit the subscribe button or the like button. It would be very appreciated.